we are trying to make space sustainable. As the cost of flushing things in space is decreasing, we are seeing more and more things sent in space, and this is not sustainable. Hello, I'm Dr. Gibelli. I'm a lecturer in space technologies at the James Watt School of Engineering at the University of Glasgow. Our idea is to be able to manufacture things directly in space using 3D printing, and by doing so, we open the door to recycling in space and to have a full circular economy. And ultimately, the goal will be to not send any more things in space and just have everything already there, recycling space debris, and having a better space segment for the benefit of society. In space, we can manufacture many things, from drugs to novel antenna. In our group, we are focusing on enhancing existing space rafts, so 3D printing radiators, antenna, solar panels. The university supported us through the Glasgow Knowledge Exchange Fund and the Impact Accelerator accounts uh, to really support us not just to perfect the lab demonstration, but really to put this demonstrator into a relevant environment. Thanks to the support of IA, uh, we're able to do a parabolic flight. So it's uh, what we also call the vomit comet, where we have a plane doing uh, roller coasters in the air. And at the top of every parabola, we have 20 seconds of microgravity, which duplicate the conditions that we have in space where the gravity do not affect the motion of objects anymore, and we're able to demonstrate our two new technologies uh, with this test. Seeing the technology actually working perfectly as I designed it was really breathtaking, really a lot of emotions, and now we know that our technology is working in space environments, and we'll be able to do the first demonstration in space in the next milestone of our technology development. The idea uh, for commercialization is with the support of the university and the IP and commercialization team to be able to translate those new technologies and the associated patents into a spin-out, to be able to bring to Scotland and the UK new technologies that will enhance the existing satellite manufacturer capabilities. Thanks to IA, we know that the technology works in space and we can really take the risk to actually go further and develop the rest of the technology portfolio that will enable us to do in-space manufacturing.